Hello friends, whenever you are, welcome back to my channel, Gilbert's Rock Paradise. In this video, I'm about to show you just a little tricky state projects to evaluate the hardship community, community space while flying this Kuching Samarahan Expressway. But we're going to start with our cruise through this first smart traffic light at Intan Junction intersection at Kuching Samarahan Expressway. As you can see now, we are starting at the uh, the junction intersection in Samarahan just at the uh, Jalan Dato Muhammad Musa and okay, now it is uh, the first traffic light smart traffic light system uh, this one here uh, it has been uh, operational for quite some time and this is the first one that has been uh, uh, completed and uh, and this has been commissioned as well the the first of five smart traffic light systems that the state government is uh, doing here to uh, to uh, ease traffic light traffic uh, jam around this uh, expressway as you all know that this expressway traffic congestion has been quite critical in the past and uh, there's a lot of critics regarding uh, the construction and uh, there are some uh, this lead to some political issues as well so uh, they're trying their best to to uh, get this done and uh, help the uh, commuters flying this this uh, expressway from point one, point point A to point B, and uh, it has improved a lot. As you can see, the traffic here. The uh, the uh, traffic runs smoothly, and uh, with ease you can drive with no uh, traffic jams uh, along the way. And the lane alignment is uh, wider this time, and uh, that helps a lot with. Uh, Committers to apply this to work or when they return from work.
The next stop will be the uh, second uh, smart traffic light conversions that is going to to be on this uh, expressway. As you can see there, it's still in progress. This one, they uh, purposely uh, delayed it because there's going to be a, a RT system here as well. So this uh, roundabout, which is near the Unimas roundabout, so uh, it's uh, it's uh, still in progress. So there's no smart traffic light system here at the moment. So, uh, but this uh, seems to be quite smooth traffic along this way. By the way, ART stands for uh, Autonomous uh, Rapid Transit Transport or Transit that uh, they will use hydrogen trams to to apply uh, and provide uh, transport system here. And the uh, there won't be any rail here, but they are using. Uh, uh, tires, so it's run by hydrogen in the future. Now we have arrived at the third roundabout and this is also supposed to be a third smart traffic light conversion along this roundabout. It's near the La Promenade Mall and they, they leave it there also for the LRT in the future and the construction of course it's still in progress. But uh, the traffic uh, here is uh, it's, uh, running quite smoothly. There's no traffic jam here. And uh, this is around big, big hours. There you can see the La Pominate Mall just ahead. And the, uh, the RT will be right at the middle there for future when it runs uh, in uh, one or two years time. There on your right is uh, La Promenade Mall. This is a shopping complex, a little shopping complex in Cushing.
Okay, folks, so we are almost near the uh, the fourth smart traffic light system that they going that they has uh, completed. This is uh, one of the uh, three smart traffic light system that is in operation now. Uh, this uh, traffic light system serving this area, Stutong intersection. And uh, it's uh, it has eased a lot of traffic woos around here, so people are what I gathered they are quite happy with this solution to to ease the traffic. Of course, if you have flyover, it will be much even better. But that costs money, and uh, actually the state government has requ requested fund for this, but it was rejected before. So they come up with their own uh, amicable solutions to to solve these uh, traffic issues. So here we go with a very uh, smart ways of uh, of relieving the uh, the uh, the traffic jam here. So right now, this is the uh, Stutong uh, smart traffic light system, but we, we are not going to pass it away yet. We are going to the left to Stutong uh, runabout. There's a Stutong runabout near near the uh, the TJ uh, shopping shopping mall. Okay, friends out there, we are still in the uh, Stutong area, approaching the uh, Stutong roundabout. This uh, roundabout is not in the uh, project for traffic, smart traffic light system. So, uh, but anyway, we are going to use this roundabout to go to the uh, the fifth. Uh, smart traffic light system at uh, Jalan Satya uh, intersection. So uh, now we are approaching this uh, roundabout, as you can see. Yeah, this is strong roundabout. This is not included in the smart traffic light conversion. So uh, anyway, uh, if you go to the left, they're, they're going to be uh, to the uh, airport. and. Uh, to the front there is going to be to the BDC. Uh, J, uh, there's a hospital there as well. But uh, we're turning right around this uh, roundabout to to Sitia, Raja Sitia uh, intersection, where you can see the, uh, the last of the five traffic lights conversion.
Right here, this is the uh, old traffic light system. I think it's also a smart traffic light system along the uh, Jalan Song uh, intersection with uh, Satya Raja. And uh, this, this, this is uh, not part of the uh, project plan, but uh, it, it was previously uh, installed with uh, smart traffic light. Okay, friends out there, we are approaching the uh, Satya Raja traffic light system. This is the, uh, the fifth of the uh, planned five traffic, smart traffic light system that is in the project uh, plan. And this is uh, completed and is in operation. So uh, there you go. and. Uh, we are waiting for the uh, turn uh, turn around for the uh, lights to go on green. Now this fifth traffic, smart traffic light system conversion at uh, Satya Raja, Jalan Satya Raja intersection. Uh, we will be uh, turning right towards the uh, Sutong uh, intersection where the, uh, the in operation the uh, smart traffic light system in that intersection is uh, the, the three of the traffic light uh, smart traffic light system is uh, being completed so yes we are heading uh, towards the uh, Stutong uh, smart traffic light intersection on the way back to to Samarahan 
This is uh, Jalan Kana, just offshoot from the, uh, the Satya Raja, Jalan Satya Raja. So we are heading towards the Sutong uh, intersections. Okay, folks, wherever you are, just ahead of us is the uh, Stutong intersections. You will see this uh, one of the wider intersections here because uh, it's also serving the uh, industrial park, the Samajaya High Tech Industrial Park to your left. And uh, to your right is, uh, of course, going to the Sutong roundabout. That's where we've been before. Now this uh, intersection is uh, with the lane alignment. It's uh, wider. And it's going to uh, Samarahan uh, Expressway.
of course, this smart traffic light system, which I consider a novel way to solve traffic jams in this area with very limited funds and resources. And uh, as you can see, of course, does not completely solve all the uh, traffic issues when it comes to uh, peak hours, but it does help a lot for the uh, commuters. And uh, so far, there hasn't been any uh, critical uh, feedback from the uh, people who apply every day around this area. So that's a good thing. So uh, I don't know, in, in your opinion, what do you think? I think it's a, it's a great thing for, uh, for a project that is uh, supposed to be uh, funded by the federal, but they, as I said, it has been rejected before, and the, the state government is using their own uh, money to solve these issues. So thanks for watching, and hope to hear from you soon. Bye for now.